is Rach, and welcome back to another 100 Baby Challenge episode. So, just to give a quick recap, um, I did stream this last weekend, so if you guys haven't seen any of the updates from last weekend, um, then we have two teenagers, um, I think we aged up Samuel and Kate over the weekend stream, I'm not sure though, pretty sure I remember aging them up though. Uh, and then we have Sarah and Jasmine. Uh, we aged up last episode, I believe, like before we did the stream. So on the stream, we've gotten all of their skills almost to level 3, except for Potty. And then I think um, Jasmine needs a little bit more on thinking. So we'll be getting those skills up today. That way they can age up to being children. And of course... Um, Samuel and Kate are going to be working on their skills so they can age up to young adults on Monday. Because today is a weekend day, um, which is a little bit unfortunate, I'm not gonna lie. Um, it's, it's not fantastic that it's the weekend because the weekend kind of slows everything down. Um, but we're going to go ahead and try and get as much done as we can. So Ivy's going to be doing a lot of painting today, I think, um, just because I feel like she hasn't been doing a lot of painting lately, um, and she's been, like, a little bit, I think, bored, because all she really does is have babies. So I'm going to try to get her to do a few things, maybe do a few, like, greeting poses, because, like, she can't do much yoga, but she can do a little while she's pregnant. Um, I think it would be nice for her to work on another skill. And then Samuel is going to come and get something to eat um, because he's going to be kind of hungry when he gets out of the shower so he can get himself a plate. Okay. Now, Jasmine is an early riser and a light sleeper. Um, so, I don't know. She's got a lot of quirks going on. A few of them are like infant glitches because I kind of skipped that phase. So... Some of them are still coming through. Um, but yeah, and then we gave, of course, the makeovers to the kids in this episode. So that's oh, exciting. Does look like we're about to have Samuel have a rampage. Um. Hmm. It's possible that we can maybe calm him down a little bit. Uh, if he, like, sleeps during the day. I don't know. Um, but as for his skills, he needs level 3 of logic so he can age up. And he also needs his responsibility, I think. I don't think he has responsibility yet. Yeah, he doesn't, so we need to work on those things over the weekend. Um, that way he can age up. She already has a level 3 video game skill. Um, so she just needs her responsibility and then she can pretty much just do whatever for the weekend so i'm gonna go have her clean up some toys because that's the fastest way to build responsibility um and i'm gonna have him go play some chess if he can okay so for some reason he can't do that um i guess he could video game maybe play an online multiplayer game with charlie Victor and CJ, maybe? Yeah. Um, yeah, go ahead and do that. I'll clean up the plate just because that gives me money. Oh. Okay. Well, you go ahead and clean it up, Ivy, and then maybe you can do another, like, couple poses. Because I would like for you to have, like, a pretty high wellness skill because I feel like, I feel like she would like to do yoga when she's not pregnant. Uh, well, she's going to be mostly pregnant all the time, but, you know, we, we, you know, she has that short little break in between pregnancies. It might be nice for her to do some yoga. Um, so, she's going to go out there and practice. Also, you might notice that this uh, slide is inside now. It's because when I was doing their movement skills, I didn't want to have to take them outside to do it. So, I went ahead and just moved that inside. I don't really know why. Um, but I just, I just decided that would be good. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and move the furniture back. Because as of now, the chairs are placed in, like, kind of a weird spot. Like, they're supposed to be, like, more here. Um, to fit in with the, the house layout a little bit better. 
so that's a little bit better. Um, let's see. Are you responsible yet? Because your responsibility actually was pretty high. Okay, so a few a few more toys put up. And we should be over it enough. Um, will it say on here? Ah, okay, good. Okay, we're gonna get let her do, I think, one more toy. And then we'll probably let her just go build her, like, fun up a little bit. I mean, there's not really much, like, you can do over the weekends. Um, which is why they're kind of aggravating for me, to be honest. Um, let's see. You need some food, so eat some franks and beans. Uh, what about you? You need sleep, so I don't know why you're up. Um, because you need to be asleep. Ivy, what are you up to? You're still working on your skills? Okay. Um, so he likes video gaming. That's nice. Uh, I guess he has, like, a little, a little hobby he can work on, besides from logic. Um, so that's, that's actually quite good. It's, it's kind of a nice hobby for him to have. Speaking as a fellow video gamer. Okay, so she's eating her franks and beans. Is her energy okay? I mean, it's not as bad as her sister's. Uh... I feel like I feel like her hers could last maybe, but like she only needs the potty skills. So I don't know. I'm gonna actually have her go potty quite a bit after she gets done eating, just because she might be able to go ahead and finish her potty skill um, without too much issue. Oh, actually. Oh no! <laughs> Tell me you didn't clean up all the toys. Oh no, she did. Oh no. Now I have to drag them back out just for him to do them. <sighs> okay, well. Oh, she's already done her homework. Okay. Okay, pop off. Um. Well. <laughs> I guess. Uh, we'll just have you keep playing with your siblings online. Um, as for him, his fun is high enough that I think I can drag out all of these toys and he can put them up and get his responsibility. I know we need a level 3 skill for him, but I think I want to get his responsibility first. So, I'm just going to drag out all of these. Um, if you guys don't know, this is a very good trick for building responsibility with your sims. Is, um, dragging out a bunch of toys and just making them put them all up. Um, it really helps with their, like, I guess, just think, I don't really know why it helps. But, um, I, it really does. You would think it would help more with the manners than the, um, you know, responsibility but I guess not I guess not so I'm just gonna put a few more of these around see if any of these can fit anywhere else okay they can because I also want a few out for the kids to do because since we are kind of like just waiting for this weekend to pass we might as well go ahead and get everyone's difficult things done so, yeah, I'm probably going to finish up their responsibility as well, even though they won't need it for a little while, just to get ahead of the ball. Ivy can now break sh bake sugar-free carob coconut cake. That's interesting, okay. Maybe I should get her one of those little meditation seats that she can do. I feel like she'd like that. This is the first time I've really seen her in workout gear. She looks so cute, especially when she's pregnant. Um, yeah, you're just gonna potty. Oh, I'm gonna put these franks and beans up so they don't spoil. I'm gonna keep a really close eye on his responsibility. And when I get the chance, I will cut back in and give you guys a 
quick little update, but nothing interesting right now is really happening. So I'll just pop back in when something happens it's of interest. Okay, so I am back with a little update. So Kobe is calling yet again <laughs> to chat with Ivy. She's trying to potty train, um, I think Jasmine right now, so she can't talk. But I love how Kobe kind of checks in on us, like, literally all the time. Um, I think that's very sweet of him, honestly. Um, because, like, none of our other kids call this often. So I really think that's quite sweet. Um, I will say Samuel is very near, uh, a fury meltdown. I don't know if it's because is it a full moon? Oh, it's a new moon. I see. Hmm. When is the next full moon? Oh, okay. The next full moon he'll be moved out by. So I don't have to worry about that. Um, preferences, werewolf abilities, and temperaments. Maybe he won't have a fury meltdown, but if you potty, then she won't get thinking. She'll get potty sealed. So why don't you talk to Blarfy and raise your attention while she watches you? Uh, and you can play some video games. She's doing really great. She's like level four, so I think um, we should get her into like some sort of video gaming career. Also, Ivy is doing really good. Um, she's almost to, like, level 2 of photography. So, I think level 2 of singing. So, maybe I should work on some of her skills. Like, getting them up. Um, she's actually kind of low in gourmet cooking. But I don't know. I don't know what Ivy should really do. I've been trying to, like, work on things. But I don't know. I don't know what Ivy is interested in, you know? Other than painting, she doesn't really seem to have a, a particular care. So, I don't know. Um, maybe you could do some yoga just to keep yourself busy, because I kind of need you out of my hair, Loki. Okay, don't don't ask for a bath. I need, I need, uh, uh I need you to stay still. Um, maybe just talk to Barbie just a little bit more. Okay. Maybe she'll go watch her mom because her mom can stay still and just do the painting for a little while. And that'll give her time to go do some potting. Okay, go potty a ton. And that should be enough to get your price skill maxed out. Surely. I mean, come on. It's almost halfway. Like, I just want to age them up today. You know? Like, that would be really nice. Um, okay, wait. You've reached level three? Hold up, hold up. Um, okay. You go take some potties. Okay. You're still practicing yoga. I'm gonna select a few of those just to see if I can maybe get that going. Okay, okay, I think this is good. I think this is good. Um, it looks like Steven's here, but maybe he's going home. I'm not sure. Um, he's allowed to be level three in logic, which means that he will have everything he needs done to age up. Um, so as long as he doesn't have a fury breakdown, he should be good. Damien's calling. Uh, okay, so he's asking if he wants to take part in the motive trials. I don't know if I should do that. How long do the motive trials last? Because like, if they only last like a day, then that's fine. But like, if they last two days, that's going to be a problem. Okay, well, it looks like you can you can do it, but oh, oh no, <laughs> not doing that. Okay, it looks like your sims can, can actually die if you send them to that. Like, there's a small, small chance of, of death. So, um, I'm going to tell them only if it lasts less than Fortnite. Um, no, it only ends when there's one last sim left standing. If it only lasts than Fortnite, then that wouldn't be quite epic enough. Yeah, maybe next time, but dude, if I die before I age up too young at all, 
That's not gonna be good. Okay, you guys can be jokesters. Alright, how is, how is the yoga going? Yoga's going good. Okay, well, I don't really know what Ivy's doing, so I'm gonna try to, like, get her to do something. Yeah, go sell your painting. How are the kiddos doing? Kiddos are doing good. Some lady that looks like she's trying to copy Ivy is telling her that she'd make a great tech guru as a project manager rank five. Um, she's declining because I don't think Ivy would be into that anyway. And also because of the rule that says she can't get a job. Um, those two rules kind of prevent it, but you know, I think I think it'll be I think it'll be okay. That she doesn't have a job because we, we do have like 200,000 simoleons almost. So I think she's okay with not having a job. Um, you could go do one of these school projects over here. I guess. I mean, both of you guys could. I just kind of wanted you guys to like work on your skills a bit. Maybe I'll let her get to wellness level 2. And then I'll let her go do it. Like, she can go work on one of these. Since she did want to do that autonomously. And of course, we've got my little twin toddler girls here trying to work on their potty skill. I think it's going okay. I mean, they're both pretty close. Like, I mean, I think they could be closer, but... You know, they're, they're doing they're doing pretty good. It seems like this one, this one's bar isn't as, maybe, it looks like it's like smaller. Does that make sense? It looks like it's a, smaller than that one? I don't know. Do you guys have enough potties to finish your skills is what I'm wondering. Because you have, you know what, I might need to queue up two more for each of you guys because... I don't actually know. Wait, which one of you was getting a text? Oh, just a before prom invite to a party. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Um, I don't. I don't really do prom in this save. Ooh, Ivy did a masterpiece. Let's go. Okay. Yes, yeah, sell it. And now that she's sold that and Kate's done with the yoga, I think I'm going to have Ivy come do some yoga. I'm going to have to queue up a lot of yoga because Ivy's kind of gets done fast. Because she can't just practice. She has to like just do like one pose kind of over and over again. So, yeah. But, um, the toddlers are doing pretty good. It looks like they'll be level 3 any second now. And then we can age them up. Which was my main goal for this episode. Other than getting them ready to age up. So that's pretty good. Um. I love that Ivy's working on her wellness. I think that's super cute of her. And I feel like that's very on brand for her. Okay, Sarah mastered potty training. So she's. Um. Oops. Did I just move? No. Did I just move that somewhere? I did. Oh no, where did I move it? Oh no, where is it? Is it in one of their inventories? Okay, no, it's there. No, that was actually in a pretty good spot. I want, I wanted to leave that there. Okay, so you actually don't need to potty. Um, you go and talk to Larfy for just, 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 just a few minutes while your mom not while your mom, while um, your sister finishes with her potty training, don't cry, don't cry, please don't cry. Um, you're gonna need to age them up. I want you to get to wellness level three, and then you can age them up. I would like for you to mop up all these puddles and like clean the room up a little bit because this room is filthy. Um, but yeah, I want you to reach wellness level three. I feel like she looks so Barbie core. <laughs> like, Ivy is just so funny. I don't know. I love how she's also not doing a single pose. She's just standing there and she's just gaining wellness. 
Um, so Sarah, are you? Okay, okay Sarah's okay. Um, Jasmine, however, is not. Jasmine, Jasmine needs some help. Um, okay, talk. Okay, you keep. No, 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 not you. You need to do another potty because apparently you're not done yet pottying. Um, no, I can't talk right now. Sorry. Talk to Barbie a little bit. That's getting up your fun. Ivy, have you finished? Oh, Jasmine's done. Okay. Are you to where you can do another pose? Oh, okay. So she can't do any of those poses while she's pregnant. I don't see why she can't do the half moon pose. That doesn't seem particularly dangerous, but I don't know. Maybe maybe it's like the stretching to the side is uncomfortable. Seems like she could do the half moon though. Like that's that's not super hard. Help blow out candles, Jasmine. Because, uh, honestly, Sarah can talk to the bear a little longer. Like, she, does she need it more? Yeah, she definitely needs to age up faster because I need to, like, get all these needs settled for her. Whereas her sister's doing a little bit better with the need department. So I can get her needs up faster while we wait. Um, oh my gosh. Oh. No, they look so- No, because this is such a cute picture. Oh. They photograph so well. Oh, oh my gosh. Kate is freezing to death. Kate is freezing to death. Oh my gosh. No, Kate, Kate, Kate. Kate. Oh my gosh. Okay. Add birthday candles. Jasmine Asia prefers to randomize trait is going to be geek. And her child's aspiration is going to be a multi-skill slumber party animal. Okay, so we got yep. that. Tons of gifts for her are going to be coming in. Speaking of, is what's in the mail bills? No, it's not. Okay. We don't need to worry about it. Okay, help blow out candles, Sarah. Sarah, could you please not do any of that? And let's see what Jasmine looks like. Oh, she's so cute. It isn't the best look. I'll definitely have to give her a makeover. Kind of regret that I didn't get the makeover sooner. Because our toddler ones, they were actually pretty cute looks, honestly. But you know what? This is a cute look as well. Okay, so you go ahead and go take a shower. And then we're going to have to for sure start getting you some food. Uh, we're going to lay out this in the middle of the table for you to get a plate of. Yeah, I don't Let I don't think it matters really that you hate being carried now because you're about to be a child. So I think it matters a little bit less now. Okay, and you're getting a text. No, I can't go to the romance festival with you. I would love to spend some time with you, bro, but I'm a little bit busy. Uh -huh. Okay, put that in the fridge. And then... Honestly, go assist with projects. Kate, I don't know what you're doing. But it's not what you should be doing. You should be pottying, grabbing a serving, and taking a shower. Sarah age up, her first randomized trait is going to be slob, and her randomized child aspiration is going to be mental. She's going to be a whiz kid. Um, okay. And tons of gifts for her as well. Um, so needs, needs, needs. How about you? Okay, as it turns out, you also have some very important needs. It looks like your sister's already done in the bathroom. So, yeah, maybe take care of that as well. Um, let's see how Sarah aged up. Okay, so she has a cute, cool, like, kind of short little hairstyle, maybe. 
yeah, it looks like she has a short little hairstyle, so that's kind of cute. Looks like green maybe is her favorite color, greens and blacks. So I'll have to remember that for her makeover, of course. Um, I think Ivy would tell her to like go ahead and go take a shower and stuff in Ivy's bathroom because Ivy's house doesn't have a lot of bathrooms. I'm going to be honest, that's something that if I made a house specifically for a 100 baby challenge, I would definitely change is because I feel like I didn't add enough bathrooms like the bedrooms yes I had enough of those especially if I added bunk beds to the rooms I definitely had enough bedrooms but only having three bathrooms that was a mistake like that was a big 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 mistake and I don't I really don't think I thought that part through like I was thinking like okay that'll be enough bathrooms because it normally is for most of my legacy saves but it's it's not it's not enough it's not enough when you're playing a 100 baby challenge. It's just not. Okay, um, Sarah, so you're taking a shower, you're gonna potty, and then we're gonna come down and get some franks and beans as well. You're getting some franks and beans, you're getting some franks and beans. Ivy's not hungry, she's helping out with this project. Okay. I think everything's actually going pretty good. Um, we're going to be working on her logic and mental skill so that she's all ready to age up. She's already got level 2 of the mental and level 1 of logic, so she should age up well. And Sarah also has a level 2 skill already. She already has a level 2 social. So, I mean, I think, I think we'll actually be okay on the skill front. Um, I'm a little surprised on that because... Normally, I kind of have like a rough start with the skills, but it looks like everything is actually going kind of okay. So, maybe we lucked out with this one. Maybe these kids are going to be a lot easier than normal. Um, but yeah, and also this this money trash can. May I just say it's it's really quite good. Prom is starting. Skip prom for sure. He's about to go into a rampage. I really don't think that's the best thing for him to be doing right now. Um, also, since he's about to go into a rampage, I think he needs to go to sleep. Um, and if you could come downstairs, mop all of this up, and clean this up for Ivy, that would be great. Um, yeah, he's like two seconds away from a rampage. Ivy is doing something on the computer. She's chatting. So that's kind of interesting that she's doing that um kind of interesting she's gonna go ahead and potty take a quick little shower before bed um just kind of get everyone's like needs up before i quit because i don't want to leave anyone's like needs off really bad because um i know when i come back in i'm always a little bit disoriented that's not your room this is this is your room Okay. Um, I mean, I'm always a little disoriented when I come back into the game. So I'm going to try to get everything set up to where I have. No chance to be disoriented at all and everything goes super good. So the toddler room is all cleaned up for the new babies um, when they come. Uh, and it looks like we've got everyone's skills ready. Yeah, we should be ready for sure Monday. Um... Yeah, so I think I'm just going to send everyone to bed, honestly. And I will see you guys in the next one. I'm super duper excited for um, us to start, like, really getting into um, the kids, like, aging up further. Because we are really, really close, actually, to um, getting this challenge done. Like, we're kind of... We're kind of in, like, the home stretch. I know we're a little far off for me to be saying that, but since Ivy's pregnant probably with twins, um, yeah, I, I think we're kind of in the home stretch a little bit because she's probably pregnant with twins, if not triplets. So that's going to put us, like, at 64 or 65, depending on how many babies she has. And then on top of that, like, all the kids are getting aged up and out really fast. I feel like we've settled into a good groove with me aging them up. 
so i i feel like we're i feel like we're gonna really i feel like we're really gonna gonna get this soon um if i had to guess i would say we're gonna finish the 100 baby challenge pretty quickly into the new year i would say pretty quickly into the new year we're gonna be able to um to, to have this done which i'm partly really excited for because i've got some new plans but then part of me is also kind of upset because like i've been playing this challenge for a very long time now and it's kind of weird to think about not doing it like it's kind of like mm, it's been like a weekly schedule for me for so long now i don't know what i'm gonna do but um yeah everyone is asleep for the night um and before the chaos starts for the next morning i think i'm gonna go ahead and lead this here um, so if you guys have any baby name suggestions for any of the future babies, then please leave them in the comments because we are running out of baby name suggestions. And if you guys think I should give Ivy's house a little remodel, we were discussing that last stream, and I think maybe I should consider it. So if you guys think I should, then go ahead and leave me a comment with that. And don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you really enjoyed um, because it just it lets me know that you guys are enjoying all the Ivy content. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye!